By 1913, Illinois allowed women to vote in local and presidential elections. Chicago's Ida B. Wells wanted these new votes to matter. She formed the Alpha Suffrage Club, an African-American women's club with a goal. Elect an African-American leader to represent Chicago's second ward and improve lives in the district. The club women canvassed block by block to register new women voters. Wells wrote, men jeered at them and told them they ought to be at home taking care of babies. Others insisted that the women were trying to take the place of men and wear trousers. Despite harassment, the women produced results. They added 7,290 new women voters in a ward with 16,327 registered men. Enough votes to make a difference. In 1915, Oscar DePriest was elected in the second ward as Chicago's first black councilman, defeating three white opponents. Women voters, many registered by the Alpha Suffrage Club, accounted for over a third of his electoral victory. <laughs> 